Hey guys, welcome to another video. So today I'm going to be comparing the new version Reflan Kennel versus the old version. So Reflan Kennels did release their new version in, I think it was January of this year. They made some new molds, made some updates to the kennels, and have released a new version. So there are a few things that I want to touch on before we get into the actual comparison. Now if I'm not mistaken, the wait time listed on the Reflan website for these kennels is like 12 to 16 weeks, something crazy. Um, and I don't know if people who order directly through Ruffalan are getting them quicker than that, I'm not exactly sure. But I ordered two of the new version kennels, uh, two larges, from Orvis. Their estimated wait time was about eight weeks, and I got them in about four weeks. So they came in about a month, and they were actually a little bit cheaper than the Ruffalan website, and their shipping was only $20 for two kennels. Which is pretty crazy because I'm pretty sure the shipping off the Ruffland website was like 60 something dollars for one kennel when I was looking there. So I highly recommend Orvis. Fantastic customer service. Seems to be a significantly less wait time for the new kennels than the Ruffland website directly or other sites that uh, have these kennels. And another thing to note is that they just have the single doors, so they're, they don't have any extras, at least when I purchased mine, there was no availability for side doors, double doors, extra holes, things like that. It was strictly the new kennels, single doors, and they had intermediate, large, and extra large, I believe. I will have Orvis linked down below and you guys can take a look. But I was extremely happy, basically, with the ship time, the cost, everything about it was just a really good experience. So if you're looking to try to get those kennels a little bit quicker, I highly recommend Orvis uh, if you don't have special needs, like extra doors and things like that. So let's jump right into the comparison. There really isn't a whole lot different with these kennels, uh, but enough where they up the price a bit. So let's go ahead and get right into it. My new second version kennels have arrived, so you know I'm going to make a comparison video. So honestly, let's just jump right into it, because there isn't a whole lot that's changed um, with these kennels. The price has gone up, <laughs> I will say that, but the measurements, internal and external size, as well as door size and all of that hasn't changed. Now, I don't believe they are making orange anymore. Um, I do not see it available, but they have made the dark gray or the millstone available as a regular color moving forward now. Now the biggest difference you're going to see is, I would say, the top of the crate shape. So you can see the orange is just like a giant rectangle, and this one has a lot of different crevices and shapes going on. Now. The first thing is the handles come standard with these kennels now. So you do not have to pay extra for the handles and they've made them where they lay flush within the kennel so that when you stack them, you don't have to take the handles off. So they lay down flat, which is fantastic. I will also say that just getting this one out of the car for a smaller framed female the handles are a game changer. Like, I probably should have ordered them for those kennels, but I just never did. But they really do make a drastic difference. Now, because another kennel will still stack on top of this one, I have no reason to believe that the trays also... Uh, I mean, I believe the trays will stack. I have nothing that would tell me that they won't stack on these new kennels. A big thing is, is I did buy the coupler set. Uh, to attach mine together since I'll have two larges and having these inlaid changes like the location so the coupler set will still fit but they sit kind of forward um, a bit when you attach them just because of this cutout here. But other than that they are genuinely the exact same kennel. I do notice just right now looking that the old doors, I don't know if you can see that, there you go. The old doors had the RTK like cutout on them, 
the new doors do not. Doesn't really matter, but just uh, something I see that's different. Now this millstone is beautiful. It is a dark gray with white, black, and orange specks in it. But yeah, those are the two kennels, new on the left, old on the right. But yeah, honestly, if it's just for the handles, like, do it. <laughs> totally worth it.